Hi, I'm Rachel, and I'm going to be showing you how to make a craft today. So, when we look outside, what might we see? We might see a bird, or some pretty flowers, and if you're lucky enough, you might see a friendly beetle that is known as the ladybug. This is our finished ladybug craft and I'm going to be showing you how you can do it at home. First, we need something to protect our table from the paint. I used newspaper and a board. Next, we need something to hold our paint. I used a palette, but you could use a paper plate if you don't have one. We need a glass of water to clean off our paintbrushes and I used a paper towel to dry them off. I used this paintbrush to paint. These are my black and red paints. You could use liquid or stick glue. A pair of scissors a white crayon, a black piece of paper, and don't forget about the paper plate. Okay, let's get started. The first thing we are going to do is paint the plate red on the bottom side. Squeeze some paint onto a plate or a palette and use your paintbrush. The next step is to let the plate dry and put it aside. While our plate is drying, you can trace around the cup on your black piece of paper using a white crayon or pen. The reason why we use a white crayon or pen is because it will show up on the black paper and you will get a perfect circle. Once you have drawn the circle, you can cut it out from the paper using scissors and for this step, parents might want to help.
Now we can make the antennas. You can cut a strip of black paper from the edge. Once it is cut, fold it in half and cut down the fold line. My brush had red paint on it and I wanted to clean it, so I'm swirling it in water and wiping it down on paper towel. When our plate is dry, you can start painting black circles onto the red side of the paper plate. After, you are going to paint a black line down the middle of the plate and let it dry. I am now gluing the head and antennas together. Once that is dry, you can flip the plate over to the other side and put some glue down for the head and antennas to stick to. And we have completed our ladybug! Hello again! Hope you had fun with the craft. I'm going to hang mine on the door, so I need a piece of tape. You make the piece of tape into a circle. Then you stick it on the back of the ladybug's head. And then it's ready to stick on the door.